I've been coming to this country for 10 years now, touring, and uh, year after year, I just couldn't believe how magnificent this place is and how different and with all its beauty and, and warmth, just magnificent. And I made myself a promise that when the time is right, I will make this place my home. And I can't believe it after all these years, it actually came true. And now I get to tell you my story. The No Face Journey with my friends. What's up guys? We just got back from the pool. Marcus is over here. He's afraid to go in his room because the AC is on and TiVo is sleeping. But this is our nice little uh, office that we are slowly building. And then of course, let me show you our little kitchen. That is also very small, but very effective. We're about to make some sandwiches. I'm gonna to go to the gym. We'll go to the gym every day with Marcus, except for Sundays. Yep, that's Marcus Martinez. One of the guys I convinced to move to the Dominican Republic and start something crazy and new with me. Marcus is originally from Mexico, Monterrey to be exact. And now he's here. And those are my girls. Well, at least one of them. You'll see the other one later. Marcus works a lot. He loves making music. And I think that's why I love working with Marcus is because he helps me keep that drive going. Because without that drive, what else do you really have in life? You know, you have to keep moving and you have to keep exploring the world and exploring yourself more importantly. All right. So we're at our spot. We're going to the gym with Marcus. Oh yeah, already. Three stairs down every day, Caribbean life. Making music and pumping iron. It's a beautiful spot. Pool is this way. Not too many people around. Here we go. Let's go, Marcus. Let's go. Say something. Hola, como estas? It's it's getting so big right now that you know it's finally getting into that uh, period of time in in music. For example, we had the rock stage, you know, and Nirvana was huge, you know, and then like the hip hop just blew up. People were never saying, oh, and then before that, you know, dance was big. I mean, during disco a little bit, I guess, but now it's like, like a massive wave where people can say, okay, this is comparatively as big as hip hop or rock was, you know, back in the day. So I don't think it's ever been this big, you know, it's, you know, it's going to be one of those waves where it's going to be remembered for a long time, a long time, a long time. Rockstar life, touring around the world, meeting new people, the nightlife, the stadiums, the fans, the crazy atmosphere. But now there's a new journey, a new adventure, something different, and I think you'll like it. Yeah. 
Yep, that's Tivo, my friend that I convinced to move first, actually. He was the first guy to take the leap of faith, one of my best friends, and now he is here to continue this journey with me in the Dominican Republic. That's Antonio, our new friend from Puerto Rico who has been living in the Dominican Republic for many years and he is actually in love with dance music. We randomly hopped into his shop to get a cut and he was literally blasting an ultra set from Tiesto. So we instantly clicked and now he's part of the crew and he's excited that we're here to get the movement going with dance music. Well guys, since we're gonna be doing some video. And that's my girl. New spot. And that's how we live with my friends in my new paradise, the Dominican Republic. This is only the beginning of our journey and we can't wait to tell you more. <laughs>